a sales girl earns a salary of 3000 per month plus a commission of 5% on the value of goods she sells above 10000 above 10000 in a certain month she earned a total of 7000 what was the value of goods she sold that month what was the value of goods she sold that month now uh, this sales girl here has a salary of how much? 3,000 per month. Whether she does sales or no sales, she is going to get a salary of 3,000. But she is going to get commission as well only if she sells goods above 10,000. Now, goods from 1 up to 10,000 shillings. She's not getting any commission at all. But anything above 10,000, then she gets 5% commission on that amount of sales. Assuming in one month she sells, uh, her sales were 15,000. Assuming in one month her sales were 15,000. She's not going to get commission on all the 15,000 sales. No, we are going fast to remove the 10,000 on which she's not going to get any commission. So after removing 10,000 from 15,000, we're going to remain with 5,000. Now she's going to get commission on the 5,000. 5,000 now is above the 10,000. And how much commission? 5% commission. So you're going to say 5,000 multiplied by 5% to get what the commission is. But if you take the whole amount of sales, 15,000, then multiply by 5%, the answer you're going to get is not going to be the right answer. Now, the question here is telling us in one month, she earned a total of 7,000. Okay? She earned a total of 7,000. Meaning that from the 7,000, we have salary which is 3,000, and also commission. Okay, so if you want to get how much commission she earned on this month, you can say commission will be the total amount she earned, which is 7,000, less the salary per month, 3,000. So the commission is 7,000 minus 3,000 is 4,000. So this is the commission earned during this particular month. Okay? But the question is also telling us that the amount of commission she earns is 5%. So, so now you see we have commission in terms of percentage. And we also have commission in terms of money, in terms of the amount, okay? Meaning, meaning 5% uh, is 4,000, okay? So you can say uh, if 5%, if 5% is 4,000, 5% is 4,000, so 5% is 4,000. What about 1%? How much? Five percent is four thousand. What about one percent? How much? So it will be four thousand divided by five. Okay? So by five once by five eight hundred. So one percent is eight hundred. Five percent commission, which is four thousand. Five percent we are given commission of five percent. Four thousand here we calculated and found out that commission and is four thousand. Now five percent is four thousand. What about one percent? Is how much? Now what about one hundred percent?
it will be how much? What about 100%? Now, what is 100%? 100% is the total sales on which she earned this 5% commission. 100% will be the total sales on which she earned this commission here, 4,000. Okay, so if 5% is 4,000, what about 100% is how much? So it will be the one for one, uh, for the one for one percent, which is 800 multiplied by 100. Okay, so 800, which is for one percent, multiplied by 100%, which is going to give us 80,000. So this is the sales on which she earned commission of 4,000, or on which she earned commission of 5%. The question is, what is the value of goods she sold that month? What is the value of goods she sold that month? Now, she sold 80,000, on which she got a commission of 5%. But then, we know that there's an amount which she does not get any commission. And that is 10,000. So the total sales will be the sales on which she doesn't get any commission, which is 10,000, plus the sales on which she got commission, which is 80,000. So uh, sales total sales is equal to 80,000 plus 10,000, which equals to 90,000. This is the total, this is the value of which she sold that month. And the answer is uh, C.